Welcome back to another episode of... Okay, here we are. Do you know where we are? We are at Reptilia. Reptilia. All right. Last time we came here, it started pouring right when we got right here in the parking lot. Today, we were going to be luckier, right, Miriam? Yeah, yeah we're going to have lots of fun. And if you haven't yet, please subscribe to our Travel and Van Life channel. All right, let's do this. Yeah. Woo! The entrance fee is only 150 pesos per person. So if you're in the area of Tagaytay, check out Reptiland for a lot of fun things to do with your kids. Most Reptiland activities are outdoors, so make sure to check the weather before going there. Wear comfy walking shoes because there are lots of stairs. And a whole lot of walking. If you're a nature lover and you want to share the joy of being in nature with your kids, then this place is perfect for you. This whimsical hobbit house will surely tickle the little one's imaginations. Almost bit your, bit your butt. <laughs> Check out the view of the surrounding forest canopies from this artistic lookout point. And if all that walking makes you hungry, stop for a bite to eat at their homey restaurant. Their brewed coffee is simply to die for.
child's adventurous spirit awakened with this mini zip line for only 50 pesos. thrilling experience, drive around an ATV for only 100 pesos. We lived in the nostalgia of the old days, at the playground of Pinoy games where you can find traditional Filipino games. That's the point. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I have a confession to make. <laughs> if your kids love to watch magic shows, check out the magic shop. You can even buy some of the things that this magician uses for his magic tricks. Also, a pottery area that hosts pottery workshops from time to time for, for children on educational trips. But for 150 pesos, your children can paint their own pots that they can take home as a souvenir. Don't forget to subscribe. Sending love from God.